Baby. Mm -hmm. You gotta get up. I know it's early, baby. I didn't sleep last night. Why not? Because you know, you anticipate the alarm. Oh, yeah. Alright, baby, we gotta catch a fight. Look, I caught these Kobe's at Ross for $59. This is my first pair of Kobe's. I like them. This joint's pretty dope. James is downstairs. You ready? Okay. Yep, I got all my chargers. You told me to quit my job so we can live our life and live our dreams. Hey, look, what are we doing? Ouch, here. What the? Good morning, bro. Good morning. Do you mind if the vlog knows that you drive Lyft? Or is that something that you'd rather them not know? Bro, I'm the undercover Lyft driver. Oh, okay. Wishbone. Hi. I'm staring at the dog. Yo, right? you're our neighbor's cat, right? <laughs> First of all, James is a cat person, right? I'm not a. You are I, a cat person. I he has a cat. a cat, and he has a black cat, babe. That's it has a white tuft. Little yeah. tuft. <laughs> a little white tuft. A Chester? <laughs> a singular. A singular Chester. Happy birthday, in case I forget, which I probably won't. But happy birthday. Hey, I got a bag of avocados and apples for you, bro. <laughs> no, seriously, we're about to be going for like a week. That's gonna go bad. He's like, <laughs> who can I pawn this off on? Nah, it's not pawning. I could have just threw it in the trash. This is true. I don't, yeah, I don't know if I've ever like. I felt really like a dead avocado. You, what? You've never had one? He's a cat person and he doesn't eat avocado. Who I'm is this guy? I'm, I'm getting out of here. Yeah, I felt like such an old person. I just gave someone a bag of fruit. That's right. That's some real old old person stuff right there. You've officially been christened as an old person. Yeah, I'm 34. Great one. You know how to get to the airport? No. All right, um, and make a left. You got a ball? What you got a ball in your trunk for, bro? You can't ball. Bro, it's, it's been a minute, you know what I'm saying? Like, that. <laughs> I just want to rally, rally, rally with her. Yo, I gotta use like. We, we end up using like eight of these bins. I never even told him that it's your birthday weekend, so it's Kimmy's birthday weekend. And we're flying to San Fran. This is my first time going to the Bay Area. I've never been to the Bay. I love travel, right? But I especially love it when we're traveling to a place that I've never been before. Yeah, this is our first time. Yeah, and this is our, yeah, so this is our first time traveling somewhere that neither one of us have, has visited before. So this is, this is gonna be a monumental trip. My boy is turning 28. Bring me my mimosas. Like, what is this for? What is this for? <laughs> for your phone? We just landed in Chicago. Flight was great. Have no clue what we're about to do. We sat next to the sweetest old lady. Like. She has a soul that that just nurtures anyone she's around. She gave me she, re a part she reminded. Of her sandwich. Oh yeah, she gave Kimmy a part she of said, her sandwich. Hopefully this will this will keep you full for a little bit. Yeah, she gave Kimmy a part of her sandwich. She reminded me of Drake's mom. She was from Chicago. Chicago. I have no clue what we're about to do, but I'll check in with you guys in a minute. I guess.
listen to me. Travel is a gift. I don't care if you have to spend your last dollar. Travel this country, travel this world, see it all. It will change you, I promise. So this is the Painted Ladies. Yep, Painted Ladies. The, like apparently this is where they film Full House. Yeah, one of them. Which is the only thing I know about San Francisco. <laughs> We're on our way to the gym. And this is why we opened up a Planet Fitness account so that when we travel, exactly. we have a gym to go to without stressing about where the hell we're gonna work out. So we're on our way. What highway is this? Five. Look on the GPS. Five eight. Right there, look. It says right there. Heading towards Oakland to the Planet Fitness in Oakland. And uh, yeah, I don't know. What are we training today, babe? I don't know. Let's do legs. Legs and chest. Does that sound crazy? No, let's do it. Okay. Legs and chest. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I didn't get any water just now. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, y'all know we have plenty of fitness, so I gotta hide the camera. Looks like a baby. Don't laugh. <laughs> Even in Planet what? Fitness, I be massaging. <laughs> Yo, she laughing at me sneaking it's around so with my funny. camera and my in my yeah. sweater. <laughs> Look, don't overthink it. Get to the gym, pick some compound movements, do a few sets so you feel like you did some work, and then go home. Like, when you overthink it, you talk yourself out of working out, you make it too complicated. It's harder to stick to it if it's too complex. Make it easy. Get to the gym, do a few lifts, break a sweat if you can, and then go home. Just make sure you're doing this consistently, and then you're gonna win, I promise. Time to knock out this cardio. I kept it super simple. I always keep it super simple for the most part. And I want y'all to keep it super simple. The details for this workout is gonna be on bricksfitness.com. I want you to try to work out at it. It was like four exercises, some core and some cardio. Super simple, compound movements, working multiple body parts at the same time. Get in, get out. An hour and, an hour and 10 minutes. So now I'm on these stairs. If y'all know me, y'all know I love the stairs. And then I'm gonna get on with my day. In and out, y'all know what I mean? This is so Bro, my, like my, my shorts are sweating. So That's how you know you worked out hard, when you're, not just your shirt, but your underwear and your shorts are sweating, yeah. are sweating, are wet. 